This issue has our free bumper knitting book with 30 gorgeous jumpers, wraps and even hot jewellery. Don't miss it. Tonight, I'm taking you on an African safari. We're going to visit exotic places you only ever dreamed could exist in this urban jungle where we live. Come on, chop chop. First stop is out of Africa in Manly, which is a hip little joint right opposite Manly Wharf. The owner is Hassan Masouli, who was honoured as an excellent ambassador by the King of Morocco, so I'm in good hands here. Now we're going to have a summer salad of the Moroccan style with the couscous. Hassan's making the salad with fresh leaves, mouth-watering citrus and blue cheese. <laughs> He's put me in charge of the dressing. We need some little marabou here, please, if you can. Yeah, sure. And I'm going to give you some of uh, the preserved lemon. Yeah. Pop that okay, we've got preserved lemon here and we've got coconut cream. Yeah. And you can just whisk it. On top there, you're going to sit and don't put too much of Malibu because only if you have a, a party after that, yeah, you can enjoy it, of <laughs> course. All the food here tastes out of this world, like the mezza plate of gourmet roasted veggies, each with their own distinct flavour. Everyone loves the traditional tagine. This one's fish with Hassan's own spicy tomato shamula and preserved lemon. Lamb Societies is another sensation. Tender lamb backstrap served on a bed of dry fruit rice and sweet madras apricot sauce. This one is such a hit, the sands bottled it so you can make it at home. But don't head off just yet. Round off your meal with a Kahlua crepe. Magnificent! Drinking mint tea is the true expression of Moroccan hospitality. And what I love about Out of Africa is that not only can you sample the taste of Morocco in, but you can take the flavours and the recipes home with you. Peace out. Morocco and roll into Out of Africa in Manly. They're open every day. Book your table on double nine double seven double o double five. Come in, Radio Cairo. Come in, Radio Cairo. Now, if you're looking for an eclectic dining experience in an atmosphere that's full of life and energy, tune in to Radio Cairo. If you haven't been to Radio Cairo, where have you been? These guys have been just opposite the Cremorne Orpheum for the last 20 years. And in that time, they've been serving up Moorish dishes, yes, pun intended, like Afro fries and Portuguese slave food. That's salt cod cakes to you and me. The Penang King prawns with mango chilli sauce are big, tender, crunchy prawns that will have you coming back a second time. Jamaican in New York is my pick. Barbecue jerk pork ribs that are so tender, they literally fall into your mouth. Strian, you're heading into your 19th year here at Radio Cairo. You're obviously doing something right. What's the secret? Really tasty food, simple, yeah. and um, just enjoying what we do. Something here is smelling absolutely delicious, and I can't wait to taste it. I think it's the is burning. <laughs> <laughs> smells good. <laughs> Which is what I'm cooking. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> So what's the secret to keeping people coming back? I think actually the price of it is number one. It's really, really cheap, but you get really big meals. Every time I leave here, I'm so full. The house-made African mint tea ice cream floats in rose petal syrup and basil seeds. And the coconut and palm sugar pancakes, well, they're the sweetest treat you will ever eat. I've just tasted the coconut and palm sugar pancake and it's delicious, but I want to know, how do you get the coconut so fresh, Rihan? Fresh coconut. Actually, North Queensland coconut. That is the secret. Don't touch that dial. Radio Cairo will be music to your ears. It's in Cremorne and main start at 18 bucks. Call 9908 2649. And don your safari suit, because you can have an African feast on me. I'm giving away a meal for two at Radio Cairo and out of Africa. Call 1902 557708 and good luck. Anything you've seen on tonight's show you want to...